are taken to Fort Meade, the largest training center to dance with the boys. Blocks of engagements and a few marriages have resulted from these excursions. If I went out to lunch and I was not going to have uh, a dinner date that night, I would go to Shoals Cafeteria or the National Press Cafeteria and for 50 cents, you'd get a really big meal and, that would, and then I would have a light thing at supper, but otherwise I would save it for my dinner date. I got here in 43 and I'm not quite sure when I joined it, but both my friend and I joined the stage door canteen. You had to be fingerprinted by the FBI. You were not allowed, the rules were you were not allowed to date anyone outside. Now that was where occasionally people did that. Washington um, just was swarming with uh, servicemen uh, on weekends especially. I mean you always saw they were always in sight wherever you went. I had a few invitations. I was pretty innocent and landed up in the wrong place and vanished as quickly as I could. So you know a lot of young men were going overseas and they didn't know whether they were coming back. On Saturdays, we'd go downtown to shop. We wore your hat and your gloves and your high heels. I became involved in recreation activities for government workers. Evelyn Walsh McLean had opened a carriage house, her carriage house to be a reception place for government workers. I had a cousin who was um, a journalist. And one day he called me uh, at the Pentagon and said, would you like to meet 